Hi, I was just honored to be on a speaking panel about dominating this market with getting more listings with some amazing other top producing agents. Uh, got a couple golden nuggets out of them, but thought we'd share a couple clips of some of the topics that we talked about. So hopefully you can get some knowledge of how to get more listings in your neighborhood in different price points. Uh, I love sharing. So reach out if you have questions or want to learn more, but hopefully you enjoy these uh, clips. What is it in your community? Is it your kids? Is it your sporting events? Is it your activities that you like to do? Getting involved, uh, brand it, you know, talk to people. Just let everybody know what you do and that you love it and you're passionate and you're trustworthy and that you will do a good job. Sometimes we'll take our sellers to their competition so they can see what buyers are gonna be looking at um, and make them become educated of why these properties are sitting and what, what do you need to do? If your neighbor lists for 100 grand less than we were hoping for, like that's critical information like that we need to know and so we don't finalize a price until the week of, of listing as yeah. well. But so you go in with the energy and what uh, Megan say, saying is be passionate. So when I came and I did all that, I didn't come in, like there's an element of confidence that you have to come in and be confident. Mm -hmm. So that was it. But I went in and I said to them, hey, look, I am going to fight so hard for you and work so hard for you when you're talking about to these other people. So I planted seeds of doubt and they're in there. You're just another million dollar listing to them. They may not work as hard, but how hard do you think I'm going to be working because this is going to make my story? Right and that home again. One of the things was it's such a unique home. It was a contemporary style home. So you know, at that point, it was like and, and green. So people are like, green? What do you mean green? Like it's painted green? I'm like, no, it's a sustainable built. You know, back in 2005, people didn't know what that meant. So I was like, we're going to talk to EPA and get all the information that they have about that. We're going to go to the embassies because where are people looking for that? People in Europe liked homes like that. So we got invited into that, and then we got written up in Washingtonian Magazine, all these things. But it's just getting the word out. Fox 5 came to cover it. You need to get one or two and show what you can do. Like my listings, you look them up, they present very well. And that's not by accident, that's by coaching my clients. This is what you need to do. You want these results, this is how you do it. I will consult you. I am you know, your educator, but you're the decision maker. So it's, it's an investment, you know, so you can say, do you want to invest in your own property? Do you want a higher price point? Do you want to grab those best buyers that come out your first weekend? Then take my advice because here's the, here's my track record. So you just need a one or two and then you need to farm that out. Like okay, you need to like send out, that would be the, the farming that you should do of, of what, you, what you were able to do, how quickly it sold, show the pictures, put the client, you know, testimonial, get a video of them, blast that all out. So you need to like, capitalize on that one or two and then it should start to snowball um, but one of the things I'm going to switch a little bit back to mindset is that um, one of the biggest wastes of time is comparing yourself to other people stop comparing yourself to other people pick what you want to do set your goal and narrow your focus then focus and be super hyper focused on what you're going to do and go do it Colors, get your own domain think about what it is whether it's you know mine's fast results um, so it's Megan at fast results it's sold at fast results so um, that's another thing. And then I, I talked about getting your own website. If you can't market yourself, how are sellers gonna trust that you're gonna market their home? And then utilize people, like, you know, tap, tap people, like reach out to us. Like, I love helping people. Like, I, I like helping buyers and sellers, but I have a new shift. I wanna help more realtors. So um, there's people that are doing a lot more than I am. That, that's one of the reasons why I joined EXP. There's people that are doing 800 million. Like, what are you doing? to be able to do that kind of volume and still have a life and go on vacations with your family. So I'm trying to learn from people. You guys should really tap anybody you feel comfortable with.